Do you think it's easier to be irreverent with music if you're not classically trained? Or if, you don't, if you're not, not even classically trained, if you're not told how to do it? Possibly, because I think if there are no rules, then you're not aware of breaking any rules, are you? Mm. But, I mean, Sleazy had been trained. I think he was taught to play the piano, wasn't he? Like I was. But um, So he's, he's the one of all four of us that every now and again will say, well, that's not in tune. As, as if it matters, you know. <laughs> but for some reason it matters to him, you know, and you have to sort of like, you know, diplomatically, you know, spin things around a bit. But I think it is, but I, I've always been of the, the mind that if you're not taught how to do something and you come in with a free mind, then anything is open to you and anything is possible. And I've always found when I've worked with... Um, trained musicians is that they seem to have a fallback formula to go on when they suddenly can't think what to do when they're improvising and I think that's the worst thing about being trained mm. is that you have a fallback that's been programmed in you whereas if you've not been trained you have no fallback and your imagination is endless <laughs>